Hello and welcome back. I hope you're all doing well out there. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing another Forzathon guide for this week's Forzathon called The Spice Must Flow. And I'm going to be showing you the quickest and easiest ways to complete it. Now, it wants you to use an off road buggy to complete all of this week's challenges. I know it says buggy, but there is no class called just buggy, so you have to use an off road buggy. Now, there's quite a few to pick from, but I went with the 2016 Aerial Nomad. Now, the reason I use this is because it's widely available to everyone and it's pretty cheap to be honest so i've also created a tune for it it's called s class and the share code is 149665371 and you can use it if you want but if you use the nomad you probably don't need a tune but it always helps now the first challenge just wants you to get 10 air skills which is really really easy so to do this i recommend heading over to bamba castle now there's loads of other locations you can use such as the quarry or mud kickers adventure park but because over here at Bamba Castle, it's almost like a sand dune type area. There's loads of places to rack up your air skills and it's really, really quick and simple. And any air skill counts. So whether it's just a normal air or an ultimate air, it all counts at the end of the day and you only have to get 10 of them. So it shouldn't really take more than two to three minutes. But like I said, you can really use any sort of buggy in this area at the end of the day and it doesn't really have to be tuned unless it's sort of a slower end buggy such as the VW bug, then you'll have to tune those up a bit. But in the aerial nomad, it's a piece of cake. Now, the next challenge wants you to win a race at the Castle Cross Country Circuit, which if, like me, you're at Bamba Castle to do your first challenge, you're lucky enough that this race is right next to it here. So again, I've created a race for everyone to use, which will save a lot of time. So you don't have to do the full sort of three lap circuit race. If you go over to custom events and you type in a share code for my race called Easy Quick Win. So the share code is 325-305-853. This is just a really, really quick race where if you know me, you know that when I do these ones, I just send the AI sort of off into the distance. So in this scenario, they go off to the left there and they get stuck behind the houses and it's literally 0.2 miles long. So it will take you less than 10 seconds. Really, really quick, really, really easy there. And the final challenge here, which as we all know, they're not really challenges. It just wants you to drive 10 miles. So it's really nothing too difficult. It's just time consuming more than anything. But of course we had a similar challenge last week. And the way I do it is I always just head onto the motorway and you can just sit flat out on there. This aerial nomad's pretty good as well with the tune because it will happily sit over 200 mile an hour for the majority of the journey. And 10 miles is about two lengths of the motorway. So it's not that long at all really probably about five to ten minutes depending on what buggy you're using but you can always keep track of it as well if you're in cockpit view as you can see here so on the actual speedometer just at the very bottom there it's got your distance in miles how far you've covered so you don't have to keep on stopping and checking the force thon stats to see how far you've gone but like i said not really a challenge at all it's really really easy and to be honest this week's force thon is actually quite simple but if you're struggling with any of the challenges just let me know down below in the comments and i will help you out as best i can as well as with any of the festival playlist monthly challenges if you're struggling with any let me know and i'll try my best to help you out also, if you haven't already, I recommend checking out my 200 million credit giveaway. So the, the winners will be revealed this weekend, this Saturday. So if you haven't already, quickly hop on there for your chance to win 50 million credits. And there is four winners on there. But apart from that, folks, I want to say a massive thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you're new to the channel, I very much appreciate if you could subscribe. And if it helped you out, don't forget to drop a like. But apart from that, folks, all the best and take care.